My name is Scott Campo with Bentley's Technical Support Team. Have you ever had trouble with dealing with a large number of valves cluttering up a model and requiring additional pipes to be added? Or were your isolation valves imported as different valve types other than an isolation valve? The inline isolation valve replacement tool in Scalibrator can help with this. Here is a model with a number of throttle control valves, or TCVs, that should have been represented as isolation valves. In order to make that change, we'll need to open up Scalibrator. If you go to the Tools tab, the Scalibrator tool can be found there. Select the Inline Isolating Valve Replacement tool. You can right-click and choose Add, which brings up the properties for this particular tool. Notice that the three valves that you can replace are TCVs, GPVs, or General Purpose Valves, or PBVs, or Pressure Breaker Valves. You can select one or more of these in order to, to replace one in your model. Here we just have a TCV, so I'll just go ahead and select that. There are a number of other options that are available that will detail exactly how your equivalent pipes are added in here. For instance, the Use Equivalent Pipes is checked with a Modify Diameter selected as the default. You can also modify the roughness value for this. Where this comes in handy is that if you have a TCV here where the pipe diameters on either side of it are different. For instance, if one pipe was 6 inches and another pipe was 8 inches, the replacement pipe will be a, a modification, basically an equivalent value of that. After selecting or defining what you wish to use, click the Compute button. When you do this, you'll see a summary of the operation. Here you can see that three isolation valves were created, three TCVs were deleted, and then in addition to that, we have six pipes that were deleted, basically the six pipes that are on either side of our three TCVs, and three equivalent pipes were created in their place. So we'll go ahead and close this, and we'll close Scalibrator, and we'll return to the model. Notice that the TCVs that were here previously have been replaced with isolation valves, and now we have a single equivalent pipe instead of two pipes on either side of the model. You'll also notice that the placement of the valve is basically in the exact same place that the TCV was there, and that the isolation valve is connected to the pipe or associated with it. You see that by the dashed line that's here. You can also confirm that by looking at the properties of the isolation valve. Here you see the reference pipe is listed as P12, which is the pipe that it's connected to. Information on Scalibrator, the inline isolating valve replacement tool, and much more can be found on the Hydraulics and Hydrology section of Bentley Communities. Thank you for your time.